hello guys welcome back to my channel my god i think it's been a while since we shot this uh that is the makeup bit of it but um i would like to say for the new guys feel really really welcomed and enjoy yourselves i'm doing this with my bare face eyebrows already done definitely because i want us to try a new foundation yeah if you're following me on instagram definitely you know the foundation i'm talking about um i want us to tip a little bit away from the drugstore products and try and use these high-end products so let's have a look at how these products will look on my face don't worry guys my face has you know a little bit of texture but yeah we'll get through with it so yeah let's not waste time let's let's start so i've already um primed my face i've used maybelline um uh, primer yeah so so here's the foundation it's lancome it's long wear 24 hours it doesn't transfer and um yeah you can see uh, we need to shake it before we use it trust me guys just to show you how much i love you i've not even tried using this product out of curiosity and all that you can imagine i've not even used it i wanted to try it with you people and then we see how it feels so i think i'll just put a few squats will be nice and then um we also want to see the coverage then this this is shade 13.3 so if we're sharing the same skin color you can definitely go for that i use this brush to apply it just I'm already feeling how it feels on my skin. My God. And then sometimes when you're blending in, just try not to form faces yeah because i can say it in swahili when you're giving your face uh different angles like this like you know yeah just relax and blend it in slowly As you've noticed when blending in sometimes you don't need to go to uh, your forehead first because you don't need to have a lot of product on your forehead since you look um, super baked and funny look it will make your foundation definitely look muddy on your face So you just go to your forehead with the final bit of your of the product that has remained on your uh, uh, blending on beauty blender. foundation is so lightweight on my face what hmm? I'm repeating this part because it it is highly textured so 
just want it to be a little bit smooth So finally, right now I'm just ensuring my foundation is well blended. So never be in a rush when you're blending foundation on your face. Yeah. Don't forget about your the lower part of your face. And yeah, that's it. So oh guys, I really, really feel good. Eh? Feel really good with this. So the next one I'm going in with is a Maybelline concealer. This is um, shade 45. try and look up so that the product gets in well under your eye so guys you can imagine uh, when I was putting my powder um, when I was putting my setting powder whatever the camera had gone off so sorry about that bit these things they happen sometime because you know you are so much absorbed in what you're doing that you even forget your camera stopped running you know what guys sometimes in life i used to ask myself will i ever own some things <laughs> Say, see, um, everything has got its timing, so rush no one, you do not rush God, He has plans for you. So, yeah, I will leave that bit, guys, and this other part I will clear it later after I'm done with my eyeshadow and all that. I don't really want to put so much, and eyeshadow was not part of this tutorial, so definitely I'm going to do this out of um, um, I'm not going to shoot this part of my eyeshadow application, but definitely I will be back, so just hang in there. So guys, I'm back. I shadow lashes. All that is done. Let me just finish up with my lips. Um, I was trying to get something really, really nude. So this is just close to nude that I wanted, but uh -uh. we'll just keep it at that because I think this is the nude I can get. This is the far, far I can get. So I think I need to get John Akinovia's products because the nudes in there I can really achieve um, what I want but otherwise this is it um, this is the makeup look for today and yeah let's wind up with a setting spray really have to shake it that's what i hate about this uh, setting spray please refer me to setting sprays that i don't have to shake <laughs> i think that's enough so.
we are drying up slowly make things dry up so fast you don't have to do this guys really um guests I just want everything else to pop out nicely so that's why I'm using this I love love this face my god I don't even feel like I'm wearing foundation So let me switch to the outfit I'm supposed to wear today before I leave and we can talk. So this is the final look for today. Hope you like it. The coat in the bralette. I don't know why it's going so low like that, but yeah. And yeah, this is the end of our tutorial. And guys, I hope you've loved it. In case you have, please ensure you subscribe. Don't just watch and leave. Leave a comment in case you have any. You can share with friends. You can like the video. Not you can, please like the video. So yeah, uh, with the Lancome foundation, guys, this is very, very interesting foundation. Very lightweight. I've never felt this lightweight foundation on my skin ever before. So it's something really, guys, you need to go to and you need to go by and try for yourselves. If in case you're interested in um, me getting you one, please let me know in the comment section or you can DM me. Or otherwise, you can also get it with um, there's this two. Oh yeah, so I would love to leave you guys. So enjoy your day. Thank you so much for watching and always being here. See you guys.